Here we are, Dumpsterinos and Frugalistas at one of our favorite Aldi Dumpsters. And what's inside? We have some boxes. We have a lot of boxes. We have a lot of trash. At first glance, it definitely just looks like trashy trash. The trashy trash is the trashiest trash. A lot, a lot of boxes. Well, look, 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 look. It's worth getting out of the car just to get a few bananas, if you ask my opinion. Ew, gloves, ew. Strawberries, ew. All right, here, we got a box, a little fruit, a little cucumber action there. The stack of pallets can be our table. It doesn't look like a whole lot, Frugal Daddy, but we, get some, we got some fruit. We got that oil. Is it oil? Oh yeah, that's hoagie sandwich oil. Okay, good eye, good eye. They threw out a whole plastic garbage bag with just this tiny little trash. Sub dressing. I just said that. All right, submarine oil. I don't even have to make one. Oh, you got another one. Ooh, guacamomo. Have we discussed how much I love guacamole lately? Or ever? Ooh, more bananas. Ooh, those are not good ones. We don't like them. But there's another one under that receipt. Oh, look at all the... Is that... Okay, oh, it's broken. Oh, God. Look, the glass is all smashed. That would have been such a good find. But no, we're not going to pick shards of glass out of our coconut oil. There's a nice banana. Really good strawberries. Good strawberries over there, you said? Ooh. I want that one. Got some moldy ones on the top, but got some good ones on the bottom. I see some chicken. Nice bag of unopened kettle chips. Is that a whole chicken? Yeah. Wow. Oh, might be a turkey, like a young... Well, let's see. Let's see. Come on, like the never frozen. It's a chicken. I almost called the chicken a human being. I was going to say a whole human being lost its life to just end up in the dumpster. It's an, a whole chicken just lost its life. But it's like a human being. They're like people. Oh, you vegans. Acting like animals are as important as people. Yes, they are. You got some Havarti cheese going there. And some strawberries. Some nice strawberries. Yeah, we can take a whole box. We can get all this other guns out. Yeah, it's a nice sturdy box, and we've got some, look at that, Havarti, oh, it even has a cute picture. Those are amazing. Are you going in? I'm just up here to look around. Yeah, I'm perched on the side to get a better look in the back. Get another one of these. Deli rolls. That's nice. You can grab that little bag of peppers. Where? Right. Very good. Well done. Ooh, these are nice and firm. These aren't mushy at all. Salad? Look at this chopped salad blind kit. Can. Oh, ooh, a blind can. 2022. A blind can. Best by 2022. All right, start thinking about it, guys. What do you think's in there? I was just shaking it by my ear. It sounds liquidy, so I'm thinking canned fruit. Or maybe diced tomatoes. But anyway, as I was saying about this chopped salad kit, look, the lettuce isn't brown at all. Shoot, there was a... Um... The heated chicken bowl. There's deli meat there, and it looks like a box of cereal right under it. <gasps> Graham crackers. Raisin bran. Ooh, that looks good. Crunchy granola raisin bran. Another one. You have uncovered the hidden bounty and glory of the dumpster. Check your brass down the bowl. More oil. I see more deli rolls and bagels. Almond milk. Is that almond milk? Oh, chocolate almond milk. Oof. You want some? Yeah, we can, uh, we can use that for making cocoa for the girls. Look at that. 
March 16th. That's many days away. This is turning out a lot better than I expected. Oh my god, that's a big package of chicken. Holy cow. Oh my... Ow! It's so heavy, it's hurting my tennis elbow. My self-diagnosed tennis elbow. What's that? Southwest style seasoned chicken. Wow. Sell by 33120. 331. Which is not now. More almond milk, chocolate almond milk. Oh my gosh, lots of those rolls. A little crushed, but they're okay. The reason I'm digging over here is a tasty fruit box. Mm -hmm. There's lots of oranges if you want to. I don't know, you have to grab them one by one. But... Ooh. Is there something you don't see every day? What is that? Ooh, Danish butter cookies. Is, is it, is it? Seal is still on it. Oh my gosh. I was trying to say, is it full, is it full, is it full? And it is, and it's got the seal still on it. Oh my goodness. A spring water, sparkly, sparkly water. Very nice with a squeeze of lemon or lime. Ooh, and another. Oh my gosh, the third chocolate almond milk. What's the date on these? May 18th. I know it's hard to read. It's in that weird dot writing, but May 18th. Those will last a while, and you can freeze them. They just separate in a weird way when they're frozen, so when you thaw it out, you have to blend it together in a blender. Oh, yay on the, yay on the sparkling waters. Yeah, I like that. Oh. <gasps> Your favorite thing ever. The only thing better than one of those <gasps> is two of them. You got two of them. How exciting. Ready to go? I'm ready. Are you ready? That's a lot of food. I don't really want to leave, but I, sh I guess we should. Well, I guess it's so time. I know, it's so sad. It's so hard to tear yourself away. I might need this to get this stuff out. at that Aldi dumpster than it looked like we were going to when we first got there. It didn't look like it was going to be much, but we have a pretty good haul here, free rescued food from the dumpster. So let's take a look right now. We have seven pound packages of strawberries. Seven one pound packages is what I'm saying. We've got two pears, oranges, bananas, a cucumber, some of the little mini sweet peppers, and some guacamole. We've got the two boxes of crunchy granola raisin bran, three almond milks. We had five cans of the sparkling water. Frugal Daddy drank one in the car. We have four of these submarine sandwich dressings, basically oil and vinegar and some spices. Two of the cinnamon rolls, nine little mini cinnamon rolls in a package. Three packages of these deli rolls two boxes of graham crackers, three packages of lettuce, two are sweet butter lettuce, and then one is the chopped Caesar salad kit, the new and unopened intact package of Danish butter cookies, a package of mini bagels, our mystery can, we'll open that inside in a moment, two of these instant meals in a bowl, we have a jambalaya chicken bowl and a fajita chicken bowl. And speaking of chicken, we have this huge package of split breasts, boneless, skinless breast meat, plus a little package of chicken wings, and a Southwest style seasoned chicken. We have some turkey breast for sandwiches, some deli meat, our sliced Havarti, our whole little mini chicken that we need to cook up, and a package of kettle chips. Okay, junior detectives and mystery solvers, we're going to open the mystery can. What do you think is in it? It has a glugging, glug, glug, glug. It's hard to shake it without shaking the camera. Sorry about that. Too lazy to get the tripod. Ugh, that's why we hate her. All right, 
<clears throat> make your guesses. I am going to say... I'm going to go with the diced tomatoes because that's what I want it to be. Because that's a very valuable canned item in my book. The best by date is December 2022. Okay, I'm going to go across my kitchen now. Open this up. I'll be right back. Wait here for me. It won't even be a sec. See, not back already. Sec. I bet you didn't even know I was gone. And I was wrong. It's not tomatoes. That looks like black bean juice. Let's take a closer look. Okay, as I'm trying to flip the lid out, oh, there we go. I was pushing it down more and more and it was getting stuck. Yep, there it is. The black bean stuck to the lid. Mystery can of black beans, dipping black bean juice all over the place. Well, I wasn't really planning on making black beans today, but I guess that's what the universe wants me to do. I think I will. Oh, you know, fight cats. Why don't you fight during my video? Great mystery can, huh? For all of you who guessed correctly what was in the mystery can, well, you'll be honorary graduating members of the first freaking frugal private detective school class. Your virtual pretend certificate is in the mail. Anywho, that worked out pretty well. So thanks for watching, everybody. Thank you so much, and I hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you next time, and until then, which will probably be tomorrow, so come back tomorrow. Stay out of jail. Stay in that dumpster. Stay healthy, happy, sane, wonderful, brave, loyal, steadfast, and true. Be the true blue you that you know you are, and I know too. All right, see y'all later. Bye.